Hello. Hi. And we've got a new Grumpy Monday series starting up with Resident Evil 3. Yay. So how are you feeling today, Kurt? Yeah, good. Yeah, let's get us on the get us out of the way. I'm tired already. Hard mode. We're gonna do it easy, cause yay, easy. It's yeah, fucking it's hard mode. <sighs> <laughs> Too lazy to be a hard nut today. As is. You're not really a hard nut, Nick. <laughs> How's it going, Kurt? Yeah, good. Yeah. How's your week off? It's all right. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> what do you mean by week off? I don't I don't really get it. I don't. It's since that last game we played was shit. <laughs> Crash Bang 2 was amazing. No, Tunnel B1. Tunnel B1, oh yeah. yeah. That game was shit. It was terrible. So, uh, have you played Resident Evil 3 before, Kurt? I haven't actually, no. I own this, but I've never actually uh, played it all the way through. I finished 2, finished 1, but never finished 3. I kind of skipped 3 and went to 4. I never played. I played five. Didn't like six. I haven't played six. Don't want to play six. But yeah, I'll play three at some point. But we're playing it now, so technically I've played more than <laughs> apart from six. Yeah, six. Which I'm not gonna play. Six is alright. Yeah, it's shit. It's not as bad as people make out to be. It's shit, Nick. Let's not go into it. <laughs> how far did you get from it? Have you even played it? What six? Yeah. No. So how can you uh, judge it before you actually played it? Because it's just gonna be the same as five, but worse. <laughs> I don't know, I think I've heard it's meant to be better than 5, but it's still pretty shit. I could be wrong. What's your opinion on it? Uh, it's meh. Leon's story's good. Yeah. yeah. Chris's is alright. Jake's is terrible. Hmm. Aiden's is alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's meh. <laughs> it's a shame this game's really unrealistic, you know. <laughs> it's, it's, it's zombies wouldn't have been resist. Wouldn't, wouldn't happen. You've got to be prepared, Kurt. Yeah, but... You never know when it could happen. It's quite unrealistic. Like, scientifically, I don't think it would happen. <laughs> if, you, if you look at the facts, I don't, I don't think it could happen. Like, regeneration and... Uh, you know, people. I, might, I mean, the closest you can probably get to that is like things like in 28 Days Later, when you've got like the rage-type zombies. Because that's, I guess, possible. But I guess those would be more parasitic-type symptoms you know, affecting your brain and stuff. I didn't know, to be honest. So this game's quite shit, really, when you think about it. <laughs> this game's amazing, though. No, the whole concept of uh, Resident Evil's bollocks. So, you don't like this game because it's not realistic? No, I do. I was just, I was just saying it's unrealistic. I was going to say, you like, uh, you like Crash Bandicoot? Yeah, I do like Crash Bandicoot, just not on a Monday. <laughs> it's a difference, you know? <laughs> Ooh, where is it, zombies? Oh, mm. It's a very good cutscene, but we can't just talk over it. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably the best cutscene in the game. They think they mimic that in the Resident Evil 2 film. Yeah, they do. Yeah. I don't know why. But they have a when they shoot the helmet, they have a zombie like kind of moan into it. Yeah, I don't really get it. Well, there's no reference to the game, isn't it? It's pretty Whoa. much probably the only reference to any of the video games in these films. <laughs> yeah. Right, here we go. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, of course they're on easy mode, so you get the machine gun. No, you always get the machine gun. Do you? I thought, I, know, I, thought, I, know, I thought you get, like... Is it like a range mode when you get, like, extra weapons and shit? Actually, I've never actually been on hard mode, so you might not get a machine gun. <laughs> I don't know, I thought you did. I thought, thought you always I'm, get all I'm your probably weapons. wrong. Like, I just going by Resident Evil 2 and you have a range mode and you have, like... Oh, yeah, weapons. range mode in uh, Resident Evil 2, you get the submachine gun and you get uh, uh, the minigun. And <coughs> instant walking with it. Oh, okay. Unless you... Like, but I don't know about hard mode, but you do always start off with a machine gun and you get literally all your weapons are already for you in the well in the drawer upstairs. Yeah, yeah. And you get fight those ammo and you've got to reserve it. Ugh. You've got to fight Nemesis oh, quite a lot in this game. On it. Yeah. Well, you've got to fight Nemesis Ugh. a lot, right? Oh, going on a bit, Jesus. Fuck me, okay. Oh, fuck you now. <sighs> God, I'm still alive. It's going to be a great play through, isn't it? Sad like me. Oh. <laughs> they we're doing a whole series of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> nice. It's a great game. It's alright. I'll get you to play in a minute. No. You, you can I don't do it blind. I, 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 I It'll don't take wanna. more episodes then. No. <laughs> I'd, rather, I'd rather not play this. <laughs> what do you think you're talking about? Well, on that note, anyway, let's bring back the man of the hour. Oh. Mr. Benjamin. Do we have to? Yes. <laughs> yes, we do. Okay. Hello, Fine, ben. Hello Nick. Hello, Kurt. How's it going? Yeah, it's good. I'm a, I'm yeah. a bit ill, but I'm alright. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's jump into a fact. Ben, if you're a player, I think you will. 
three. Yeah. A little bit. Not completed it. Uh, He's amazing. That guy's a pussy. No, he's like, so you know, I'm gonna lock myself in there. I'm not gonna hang around with Jill Valentine, who bloody is like the hero of number one. He's gonna survive zombie apocalypse. Yeah, but how's he gonna know that? Well, she's famous, isn't she? Oh, right, I'm sure. Well, not really. She tried uh, at the end of number one. She tries telling uh, her and Chris tried telling everyone about the virus, but they all didn't believe her. <laughs> oh, you dopey bitch! <laughs> all right, fact. So, uh, the producer of the Resident Evil series, Shinji Mikami... Oh, you can't pronounce his name, but... Oh, he's Jesus. Japanese! Give me a break! Jesus. So, the, the producer... <laughs> Don't, no, no, that's not the sign. <laughs> Come on, Ben. He was, uh, he was against calling this game uh, Resident Evil 3 or Biohazard 3 in Japan. Uh, he felt that Code Veronica, which uh, was... Well, yeah, was, when did that one come out? Resident Evil Code Veronica. Uh, then, 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 then. You're the Sorry, I'm yeah, on the dream tangent. Pass. Tangent. Uh, yeah, he Jesus felt that Code Christ. Veronica was more of a true Resident Evil three than this one was, and he wanted this to be called Resident Evil one point nine, which I don't know. Like, great name. Like, yeah, but one point nine. Why not one point five? Like, <laughs> or one point one? I'm guessing this was oh, like. Why in, they call it four point oh? Wasn't well, this in between stories of Resident Evil one and two? Yeah, yeah, listen. Yeah. So, yes, it would make sense to have it as one. Yeah, yeah 1. 1.5 would make more sense. So, uh, uh, locations, isn't there? So. Resident Evil 1. Right, and it, it, starts, it starts uh, before number two. Mm. And then when you go into a coma for a bit, when Nemesis impregnates there's you, a bit, there's a bit where you, it goes past number two. There's a bit where Nemesis jumps out of some glass. Uh, I forgot where it is now, but in Resident Evil 2, that glass isn't broken, so it's a, it's a yeah. constant. Well, you'll see, we'll, we'll get to the station in a bit. <laughs> That's in the and station. And you'll see it's completely different right, to well, Resident Evil 2. Yeah, there's my fact. The producer didn't like this game as much as Veronica, Actually, but. we don't need this. What yeah. am I doing? Then you're putting me I don't here. like this game, so. <laughs> you know, do you fucking right. like anything? Right, so we need Is that, that a serious question? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, of course I like this. Tell I... me, give me one thing you like. What, right now? Yeah, like one thing on the spot. One thing you like. Come on, girls, come on. Chicken. Down. All right. Chicken. No, that's valid. I'll, it's, it's I'll accept that. Chicken and steak. Steak's good. Well, we all know you like snake. Steak. Yeah. Mm. Next time we get to the harvester, I'm getting a steak. Yeah. Fuck yeah. We love the harvester. Whoa. <laughs> they had an, an amazing uh, the dessert thing, those Rocky Horrors. So good. <laughs> you want to get one of those the next time we go to the harvester kit. Oh, yeah. When is the next time? I don't know. No. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever Phil can come. Oh, okay. Anyway, yeah, Ben, you might as well just go off now. Oh, yeah, I forgot oh, to yeah. Thanks for having me. Yeah, yeah it's all right. right. Love Bye. you. Bye, love you too. He's so loyal. Right. He only goes away when we dismiss him. It's great. Yeah. All right, so we just got the key out of the warehouse, and now we can go explore, Kurt. We Yay. can explore the silly. How many times have you finished this game, Nick? Um, This one. Probably only only break twice this one. Okay, so oh, you know well. where you're going then. Kind of, yeah. Good. I, I know I can get through the first half pretty easily. Uh, after that, yeah, they'll take me a little bit slower. But basically, until after the hospital bit, oh, okay. I can get there pretty quickly. But after that, then it will take me a little bit longer. Look at those graphics. Oh, these are amazing graphics. Fucking hell! Quality on those graphics, those pixels. Oh, this we go. Uh. Is it just me or the gun shooting? I noticed the physics are a lot better on 3 actually, compared to number 1 and 2. Like they actually kind of... Because right. the zombies on 1 are like, shit. Right, is it just me or is the gun firing a lot slower than it usually does? I don't know. Hang on, the way she reloads the gun, I swear they just copied that from Leon. Probably. Well, you do usually load a pistol exactly the same. Well, no, you're not. Ah! <laughs> no, because Leon always has that stupid thing where he goes, he gets the gun out and then he kind of puts it to the side so his palm's facing upwards and then he gets his hand and jams it into the side like he's a cool bastard. Yeah. But on the mercenaries mode, on the other ones, like, the other characters do it differently. But it looks like Jill just copied him, pretty much. Yeah, well, they probably... I don't know. They it's got lazy. Yeah, they Laziness. Might, lazy. They might lazy have just Capcom. used Leon's model and kind of just... God, lazy fucks. Yeah. Right, there's another shotgun here, but I've already got one, so fuck it. But then I can waste these five bullets. Yay! Blow, Blow some zombies' heads off, Nick. <clears throat> Basically, we... This first 
ten minutes is basically just trying to get to uh, the police station, really. Yeah. Okay. Fuck me, already. But, yeah, it's pretty easy to get there. That's cool. But, we need to get the lighter. Burn through a gate. And then... Burn through a gate? Yeah, there's a gate tied up with, like, some rope. <laughs> you, uh, burn your way through that. And then, you're at the police station, pretty much. Brilliant. And then we get to see Nemi. Nemesis. I used to call him Nemi. <coughs> call, call him Nemesis, Nick. Don't call him Nemi. Oh, He's not a fucking dog. I used to have, uh, when I was a kid, like... Because I've got a lot of Resident Evil stories. Yeah, yeah, go on, right. go on. Go but on. Uh, when I was a kid, like, oh. I always remember this. I had a nightmare of Resident Evil. Jesus. Well, I've had a couple of nightmares of Resident yeah, Evil. Yeah. But there was this one, right, where I, I'm running through the, uh, the... Do you know the tank hangar in, Res in Metal Gear Solid 1? Yep. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I'm running through there, right? Yeah, yeah. On the, 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 like, the railings at the top. And oh, ne yeah. Nemesis is firing at me with a Gatling gun. Of course it is. This is yeah. before the film came out, right? Of course. I don't know yeah. how I guessed he had a Gatling gun. <laughs> <laughs> right. Anyway. <coughs> anyway uh, and then I get outside, dog his bullets, and then get outside, and then Nemesis is my friend. <laughs> we go around killing zombies <laughs> together. That's a that's a brilliant dream. <laughs> it was amazing. I used to love it. Fun, imagine. Yeah. Cool. What did he sound like? Oh. Did he say anything? <laughs> he didn't know anything more stars. <laughs> you see that then? Yeah. yeah, that was cool. No, do you see what I... What? The person just ran off. No, I didn't, no. He's relevant to the story. Oh, was he? I wasn't paying any attention. It's such an interesting story. <laughs> you love my dream, did you care? Oh, yeah, I was so fascinated by your dream of Nemesis. That's what's, uh, what's keeping me <laughs> preoccupied. Cool. And this game is the first one where uh, you start... You don't have to press X to walk upstairs. Oh, okay. Oh, oh shit. What the fuck? Oh. Who's that? That is Brad. Brad, oh. The guy in the helicopter in the morning. Yeah. The remake of Resident Evil 1 was amazing. They should have made more of those. Yeah, well. Like, people complain that they change a lot in the remake, and it's like, well, yeah, but it's a remake, so. Oh, I love the one they changed. I, I thought, know, I, I thought, thought those cool changes they made. I thought bringing Lisa Trevor was amazing. Yeah. And that boss um, that you had to fight was pretty cool. Which one? Uh, the girl? Yeah, that's Lisa Trevor. Yeah, oh, right, sorry, I can't remember her name. <clears throat> yeah, she's like uh, the failed experiment where she's been tested on with, like, the G-Virus, like, the Nemesis symbiote. Yeah. Like, the Nemesis Parasite. Like, symbiote? That's Spider-Man. <laughs> Something like that, yeah. But, like, uh, yeah, it's, like, uh, it's pretty cool, to be honest. But she dies a bit shit. I swear I only treated the GameCube as a remake <laughs> purchase, because they had... I got it because of Resident Evil, and they had Metal Gear come on it, like Twin yeah. Snakes, I was like, I'll get that. <laughs> and he had two games on it, really. Just games of that remix. It's like, yay! Twin Snakes is alright. I liked it. Is uh... I thought it was a bit over the top when he just did all that. <laughs> like... <laughs> what, jumping off a, a Stinger <coughs> missile and somehow <laughs> yeah. shooting liquid out of the sky? It does look cool as fuck, but it is a bit over the top. Bullets! Got some bullets out here. Nice. Alright, so... Now we have to go and get the lighter. Now we've got the lighter. We can go and burn that gate, but... Usually, obviously, if you've done this without knowing... Who the fuck ties a gate up with rope, though? Well, if that's the only thing they got at the time. But is it... Does, is, I assume it's to stop zombies, not people. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Or both. But can they just, like, gnaw through it anyway? <laughs> like really rabid zombies just gnawing from some rope. Like, rawr, rawr. You know, if they did that, they can get through it eventually. If it was like chains and stuff, then they got less of a chance. Probably break their teeth in the process, you know. Okay. Actually, no, because they'd rust eventually. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Unless it was like that stuff that Wolverine uses, that like. I can't, what did he use? That special metal shit he has? I don't oh. fucking know. How do I forget what it's called? Begins yeah. with an A, like aluminium. Uh, Animantium. Oh, so yeah, not aluminium. <laughs> Animantium. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is it this way? Yes, I think it's this way. See, we're kind of like skipping the majority of the city, but there's some other stuff we can pick up, but we can pick up a bit later on. Yeah, this game's like, fuck me. Jesus. <laughs> oh, here we go. Fuck! Uh, shoot the barrel, do? Nick. The barrel, the barrel, what Nick. Do? Even I can fucking coming. tell he's the barrel. They're fuck coming. me. They're coming, Kurt. Oh, for fuck's sake, here we go. <laughs> fucking <laughs> make it dramatic as fuck. Go on, I'm man. waiting for him. Oh. 
Go on then. Oh, no, not him. Jeez, Nick. Shoot the barrel. No, oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> no. <laughs> Shoot him. Right, this is fucking retarded. This is, this is ridiculous. Yay! <laughs> and kill that last zombie. K k Nick! Is that a bag on a red? See it? Oh, oh there we go. Boosh! <laughs> Not anymore, I was going to try and get you to do a one line but she came a bit quick. <laughs> no, it's fine. <laughs> like usual. It's okay. <laughs> Ugh. Okay, now we burn the gate. Okay. And we're on our way. Fucking hell. Well. Find the point of hyper and wait, but it seems to be simple with oil. Well, anyway. We'll come well, back to the, this on, uh, on, next week. Yeah. Well, on the next Grumpy Mondays, we'll open a gate. Whoa! Yeah. Uh. Pulls that shit, Nick. Bye.